So we have the entire ISP looking out for Cassian Andor. They have his hologram, some basic information. So why isn't the Empire able to cross-reference their own prison intake records and figure out where exactly he is? I mean, admittedly, it took me a while to figure out that Clem and Keith Girgo were the same people as Cassian, but- He was clean shaven. Andor had shaved. Resemblance in the face is there. Then I remember that scene in the Imperial Courthouse on Nymos, how rudimentary their records were. I remember the actual intake process of Andor into the prison on Rakina. They didn't seem to do a good job of record keeping. Actually, they didn't take any pictures or records of Andor. They didn't scan his fingerprints, which now that I think about it makes sense because this isn't really a prison, it's more of a labor camp. So who exactly is being held inside doesn't really matter that much. They're just labor. I know everyone is supposed to have chain codes, which essentially were your ID in the Star Wars galaxy during this time period, but it's possible that Cassian Andor being from a separatist aligned area never received his after the war ended. And so he's just off the grid, except for that one previous arrest he had when he was younger.